Howdy guys, Jimmy Song here. I wanted to talk in this video a little bit about why Bitcoin is sound money. Uh, sound money is something that a lot of people think they know about, but you know there, there are various parts to it that aren't really obvious because we live more or less in a fiat world. Um, but anyway, uh, sound money, at least uh, by definition, is something that is sound, right? Something that is uh, unchangeable, something that is not controlled by a single party. Uh, so centralized fiat money, for example, uh, changes all the time, and that's part of the problem. Uh, they print more of it. Uh, whatever country you're in, you're probably under a fiat money system. That means that the government can print more of the money. And if you happen to be in a government that's printing an especially large amount of money, you're in a hyperinflating state. And that gets really, really bad because your savings are more or less taken away from you almost immediately. Um, and that, that's, that's a terrible situation to be in because you can't really buy things. No one's really incentivized to, uh, to sell you anything or to save or to accumulate capital. Uh, they're just focused on spending right away and that can be really really bad um, The thing that distinguishes sound money is that it is very very difficult to change That is you can't change the rules on it the interest rate very easily um, I mean that 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 depends on demand as well But you know like at least on the supply side you can't really change things very easily uh, and you can't, uh, you know, a lot of people want to own it because it doesn't change very easily. Um, gold was the, you know, gold was the standard for uh, sound money because it, it was very, very difficult to change. Um, it's very difficult to go and mine gold and it's been that way for a very long time. And because of that, it's, it's considered hard money. It is very hard to produce. Whereas fiat money, something that's centralized, something that's not sound money, is easy money. It's very easy to create. Um, fiat money in, in particular is very easy to create. If you are a bank, you can fractionally reserve, uh, reserve money uh, or fractionally lend. Uh, so that means that for every dollar that they receive in deposit, they can more or less, with uh, if you if you uh, fill out the math, uh, keep uh, ha they're forced to keep about ten cents of it, um, but they can lend out something like ten dollars, um, and this is based on a reserve ratio of ten cents. So they can they they're basically printing ten dollars for every one dollar in deposit that they have, uh, and that's. That every bank can do this, um, including the central bank, which is uh, which is what most countries have. So, as a result, uh, you know er everyone that has fiat money is under a regime that's very uncertain, and it's very hard to plan for the future. Whereas, if you are under a uh, a sound money regime, then you have much more uh, certainty about the future, and that's why sound money is important. Now, why is Bitcoin sound money? Bitcoin is sound money because it is very, very difficult to change. There's no central choke point or place that uh, that can determine that policy. You need the um, the entire community, the every node to agree to change things in order to change it, at which point, um, you know, it, it can change, but it's with your consent. So that's that's OK. So uh, in that way, Bitcoin is sound money because it is very, very difficult to change. No one can take away your node from you. No one can take away your money from you. And that's what makes it hard to change, right? It's hard money, it's sound money. And that's, that, that's why it's so important to protect a lot of these properties that make it hard, that make it sound. Uh, a lot of people think that all coins are sound money as well. It's not because most of them are centralized in some way, shape, or form, have a very obvious central point of failure, at least the ones that I've studied, um, and especially the hard four coins. Uh, so hopefully that helps you. We'll, I'll talk more about sound money in another video, but that's the, that's, this song is done.